Hello everybody and welcome to SnackTube. So I was in B&M the other day looking at all their new snacks and things that they've got in. They've got in some weird stuff. Um, and I saw some stuff there, some of it was in the new range, some of it wasn't. And I just wanted to pick some things up for you to try. Now this thing I've got for you today, it's um, a style of thing that I don't really review much on this channel, but I really wanted to try it, so we'll see what it's like. So this is Kellogg's Crunchy Nut Peanut Butter Crunchy. Um, so I don't do spreads normally, like on the channel I don't tend to review spreads that often, um, if ever. Have I, have I ever reviewed jam for you guys? I don't know if I have. Uh, but I, I really, I love peanut butter. Absolutely love it. Crunchy peanut butter especially. Smooth peanut butter is crap. Like, <laughs> anybody who eats smooth peanut butter is just kidding themselves. If you want peanuts, get some peanuts, you know what I mean? Um, so if you're a smooth peanut butter person, go. Just stop watching this video now. Um, I'm only kidding. You can like what you like, but I 100% I prefer crunchy over smooth. Smooth, I don't see the point in smooth, to be honest. Um, but yeah, don't try a lot of spreads on here. Sauces sometimes, hot sauce, that kind of thing. But yeah, I haven't really ever tried a, a spread, I don't think. Um, I've been doing this for years. I don't, I don't know if I've ever actually reviewed a spread. I think I reviewed um, a, like a chilli thing once. But I think it was more of a sauce. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, uh, so this is Kellogg's Crunchy Nut. Uh, for those who have been living under a rock for the past 5,000 years, Kellogg's are a uh, uh, breakfast company. They make cereal, most famously cornflakes, and they have Crunchy Nut, which is sort of like cornflakes and they're kind of coated in a in honey in them, I think it is, and then you get little wee bits of nut in there. Uh, it's quite a nice cereal, actually. I really do like Crunchy Nut. And this is their version of peanut butter. It says it's made with honey roasted peanuts, so I really think this will probably be quite nice because I do like peanut butter and uh, I like twists on peanut butter. There's a Marmite peanut butter out there and I keep meaning to get that to try but I don't actually like Marmite. So it's going to be one of those things I'm either going to love it or I'm going to hate it, you know. <laughs> See what I did there. Alright, let's read a little bit about this um, peanut butter. Uh, it is gluten free and vegetarian friendly. It wouldn't be vegan because it's got butter in it but Gluten-free, that's good. Although, <laughs> the one of the things is, is like, it's gluten-free, which is great for people with like celiac disease, gluten allergies, that kind of stuff. But allergies tend to come hand in hand and peanut is one of the most common allergies. So it's, um, yeah, <laughs> you probably still can't eat this anyway. Uh, but anyway, let's have a look. Crunchy, it basically just says it's crunchy peanut bar. <laughs> that's the description, crunchy peanut bar. Uh, there's your list of ingredients. I think I'll just list them off because it's fairly short. Roasted peanuts, 65%. Honey coated roasted peanuts, 26%. Um, and then sugar, palm oil and salt. The honey roasted peanuts obviously have their own ingredients. I'm not going to go into that. But yeah, pretty uh, straightforward. Lots of palm oil, which is obviously uh, bad for some reason. Um, something to do with orangutans. I don't know. Anyway... <clears throat> Uh, nutritional information. So this jar is 340 grams. It is quite heavy, to be fair. It's quite a hefty jar. Um, I don't know what you would get in a spoonful, um, how much you would get in a spoonful. It actually does have per tablespoon for your calories, but nothing else. Uh, per tablespoon, 15 grams, 87 calories. I would say in a piece of toast, I'd probably put two, two tablespoons maybe, maybe one, one or two. Too. I like to lay a lot on thick. I like my peanut butter. Um, so I'll just I'll give you the breakdown per 100 grams, although it's not very helpful. Um, energy, 578 kilograms. Uh, 578 kilograms? 578 calories. Uh, fat, 43 grams, of which saturate is 9 grams. Carbs, 19 grams. 14.7 grams. Sugar, fiber, 7.2. Protein, 25 grams and salt 1.25 grams. So I think per portion, it's not really that bad for everything. It's just it's fairly high in energy. Uh, but peanuts tend to be like that anyway. It says it's suitable for celiacs. Uh, you can recycle the jar and the cap. Packed in the United Kingdom. Yes, right. Let's break this bad boy open and see what it's like. We've got the wee 
honey thing on there. Oh, it's got one of these stupid seals on the top. I can never get these off in one go. Oh, I did it. Wow. That's how you know a product is good quality, is when the seal on top comes off in one go. And I say that about just about everything, whether it's a jar of um, peanut butter or a ready meal. See, when you buy a one pound ready meal from Asda, although I don't think they're a pound anymore, they're probably more expensive than that now, but see when you buy one of them and try and take the bloody plastic off it, it's horrible. But an m &S one, it's like... So, yeah. <laughs> Mmm, smells nutty. Uh, I suppose I'll get a wee spoonful of it and show you. I'm going to mix it up a wee bit so it's not just the bottom. There you go. Peanut butter. You can see the chunks in there, chunks of peanuts. All right, let's give it a taste test then, shall we? So this is Kellogg's Crunchy Nut Peanut Butter. Let's give it the old taste test. It's so claggy. <laughs> it's the only, the only downside to eating peanut butter. It's very claggy. Mmm. Mmm. That's good peanut butter. Mmm. Mmm, it's creamy, it's buttery, it's nutty, and it's crunchy. And you know what? You can you can really taste the honey on those peanuts. Um, honey roasted peanuts tend to have a sort of crunchier outside because the honey makes a sort of crunchy coating. You can really you can really taste the honey. I feel that extra bit of crunch from the crystallised honey on there. Mmm, that's really nice. I did bring a piece of toast uh, so that I could make up uh, toast and peanut butter so you can we can try it like that because that's generally how I would eat peanut butter is on toast. Uh, although I'm not uh, particularly happy that I've been sitting here for what is now almost eight minutes and this uh, toast is now cold but this is how you would eat your toast on a wee bit of, wee bit of bread. Eat your toast on a wee bit of bread. Eat your peanut butter on a wee bit of toasted bread. Like it melt a wee bit. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, that's really nice. I really like that. Yeah, that is um elevated. Mm. That doesn't just taste like ordinary peanut butter. It's like the, the peanut butter is nice just on its own. And then those crunchy honey nuts really add that extra bit of sweetness and the honey flavour and a, a lovely extra bit of crunch to the compared to just the normal peanut crunch. I don't know how to describe it. It's like double crunch. Um, so when they call it crunchy nut, crunchy. It's got two crunchies in the title. Yeah, it is. That is really nice. That is really good. I mean, if you're not into peanuts, you probably won't like it. But if you're a peanut butter guy, um, I would 100% recommend trying this because that is bloody lovely. That is delicious, and I'm going to eat some more. I might have to go and make another piece of toast so I can have some more of it as well. Mm, smells good, it tastes good. It's crunchy. Mm, that is lovely. 100% would buy again. Well, thanks very much for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, hit the wee bell to get notifications anytime a new video comes out. Let me know, Are you? do you like peanut butter? If you do, are you a crunchy or a smooth kind of person? You should be a crunchy person. Crunchy's better. Um, and yeah, just uh, let me know. And uh, I guess I will be back next time for another video for you guys, another wee review. 
Uh, have yourselves a fantastic day and I will catch you later. See ya.